afternoon into tomorrow. I think we'll be able to give the rain gear an opportunity to dry out for the first time in about eight days. So <laughs> that's some good news. Doppler network, though, showing the shower still persistent in the southern parts of the viewing area, especially along and south of the parkways. Notice, too, on the northern edge of that rain, a few showers north of the western Kentucky Parkway moving to the north and east. Not out of the question that a few of those could still affect the metro. Also, a little line of showers further to the north and west that we'll watch closely. Here's the steadier rain, though, from E-Town, Bardstown, towards Campbellsville, Lebanon, back to Munfordville and Hart County, over to Bowling Green. Seen some steady rain through the overnight. That's a little more persistent now early this morning. But look at temperatures from 56 in Seymour to 61 in the metro. With upper 50s, the rule, it is a very mild start to the morning. Look out to the west, too. We get into some drier skies, maybe a hint or two of sunshine today, but I think the clouds will win out. The skies still stay mostly cloudy, but temperatures up near 62 degrees. That should be an early afternoon high. I think a little later on in the afternoon, we'll shave a few degrees off of this, but still, when you keep in mind that the average high is 43 degrees, we're going to be very mild in your Tuesday forecast. The coldest of the cold air really stays locked up to the north and west. We'll cool a little bit from today as we head in through the middle of the week, but uh, nothing too chilly, especially by January standards. Now, further out to the west, big dip in the jet stream through the southwestern United States. Eventually, that'll send another system our way with good opportunities for rainfall by the time we head Thursday late day into Friday and again into the weekend. Forecast looks very soggy again. Last week, we had almost two inches of rain and it looks like all the way through this week and weekend, Another one and a half to maybe two and a half, three inches of rain looks to be on the board. Y'all might also notice the Ohio River has been inching upward as well. It's still well below flood stage and expected to be that way. But boy, some of the local creek streams and rivers definitely beginning to fill up with the rainfall. We are dry, though, this afternoon into tomorrow with a partly sunny sky. Highs a little cooler, but still 50s, 52 Wednesday, 54 Thursday as we build back in the rain for the afternoon into Friday, mainly in the morning on Friday. Drier in the afternoon. Afternoon. I still think we look dry for Saturday. Highs near 66. The pick of the seven day forecast. We build back in more rain Sunday into Monday. So only getting brief periods of drier weather to try to let that rain gear, which is pretty soggy from overnight, 